Hello perfect beauties and welcome to the acne channel. My name is Daisy and today I'm going to be talking about different ways to remove your acne scars, not just by using the banish kit, but other things that you can use. And it's so great because as technology advances, um, medical research has found different ways to promote skin, promote skin rejuvenation, heal acne scars or marks and de delay the appearance of aging. So one of these is through the use of these rollers called dermal rollers. So I have so many videos about how to use dermal rollers and how to use it in conjunction with the Banish system. So let's just go on into other skincare treatments that are comparable to, I guess, a microneedling treatment. And I will have links below if you do want to learn more about microneedling, the Banish system, Banish kit, whatever, I gotcha. Okay, so first we're gonna talk about dermal rollers versus IPL, which is intense pulse light. So IPL is a technology that is used by cosmetic and medical practitioners to perform various skin treatments for, the, for aesthetic and therapeutic purposes, including hair removal, photo rejuvenation, and acne, acne acne scars. Um, this treatment is said to increase collagen production in the skin. However, it was discovered that after three treats, three weeks of treatments, the uh, derma roller can also increase total collagen content significantly more than the IPL. The thickening of the skin brought by the banished roller effectively compared to the IPL treatment um, led to better anti-aging results and there is really no downtime when you use the derma roller. So, about one IPL treatment costs about 500 USD here in the United States, but let me know how much your IPL treatments cost in the bottom bar below. So the next thing I'm gonna be talking about is laser skin resurfacing, and that uses high intensity light emissions to vaporize the top layers of skin in order to remove acne scars or wrinkles. Um, both these two cause little trauma on the skin to elevate collagen production. However, the downside of um, this laser is that it can boil the water in the skin um, surface as it penetrates through the deeper layers um, of the dermis. And also, the tiny holes caused by dermal rolling can heal or close down within eight hours without adding any marks or scars on the skin. So laser's downtime is about seven to 10 days on average, meaning you just really can't go out or do much. And the cost is anywhere from about 1,000 to 5,000 USD for one treatment. And you probably need six or so treatments to really get your full session. The next is chemical peel. So chemical peels work by removing the layers of the dermis that induces the skin to peel off. So the new skin is usually smoother and less wrinkled than the old skin. This uses a chemical solution that causes the dead skin to go away and peel off to have an improved and smooth texture of the skin. As a result, the collagen production is increased and the absorption of beauty products is increased since the skin's natural barrier is removed. Um, though this may seem really effective, the downtime may take a long time between three to 12 weeks and it can be kind of painful and you can run the risk of burning your skin. So in comparison to the dermal roller, um, the dermal roller can also increase production and absorption without removing outer layers of the skin. And so how it does that is it creates micro channels on the skin to stimulate and repair collagen growth. And this also reduces the risk of infection. Plus the recovery period is only, you know, eight hours or so. I usually do it at night and then when I wake up, I can just go on with my day wear makeup. If you do chemical peels, you should do it at um, an esthetician's office, $75 to $1,500 each treatment. The next is microdermabrasion. So microdermabrasion uses tiny exfoliating crystals or aluminum tip crystals that are sprayed on the skin. This also helps to boost the production of collagen in the skin. However, the outer layer of skin needs to be removed in order to get the results, thus risking the patient to infection. So there is no downtime, yet it is still not effective for deeper problems such as scars, stretch mark wrinkles, or deep acne scars. So microdermabrasion can be good if you just want to exfoliate your skin, but does it really treat acne scars? I don't know, let me know in the comments below. And it can cost $100 a treatment to up to $500 a treatment, and you should get it done at a spa or a salon. Next is mesotherapy. So mesotherapy is a technique that aims to eliminate cellulite, promote weight loss, and treat sagging skin. Substances that melt fat is injected into the mesoderm layer of the skin. This can also cause side effects such as sensitivity, bruising, itching, swelling of the skin, damage to the liver, redness, and burning skin. 
downtime can last for 24 to 48 hours. So in comparison to the derma rollers, you can get the same benefits without having to experience um, long-term side effects with the Vanish system. Um, and the cost for the mesotherapy system is 300 to 1250, or sorry, $1,250 USD. And the next is the Fraxel laser. So the Fraxel laser works by causing controlled micro injury to the skin. This creates tiny microthermal zones on the skin that causes the collagen to stimulate production. Fraxel is used to target fine lines and enlarged pores and can address some pigmentation issues. It's pretty much having the same results of the use of the derma rollers, but the derma rollers are cheaper and there is definitely a lot less downtime. So the lasers cost about 500 to 750 USD per session. And let me know in the comments below how much it costs you guys, um, because it really depends on where you go, what areas you're in, what doctors you go see. So it's important and necessary to research and compare different cosmetic treatments to find out which is best for you. And it is your very right to, cho to choose a cure based on your convenience and financial ca capacity. So if you've tried the Banish system and that doesn't work for you, then you can also try um, the methods that you know I had mentioned earlier. But the Banish system, I know people think it might be a little bit expensive because it's about $69 for three uses. It is a lot more economical than you know the other treatments out there for scarring because scarring is a very hard thing to get rid of. Um, it's not like a cosmetic thing where you just put on foundation and there you go. It's actually really treating the skin and making it look different. So take that for what it's worth. And thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I create acne related content every Tuesdays and Saturdays. And in the bottom bar below, tell me what has worked really well for your acne scars. Have you guys tried the lasers? Have you tried um, microdermabrasion? What has worked the best for you? Talk to you guys later. Bye. You